Oh, hey, sorry I didn't notice you there. I just got home from a really long weekend out on crack cocainus. Anyway, after a big night out, it's very important to keep up your potassium levels, which is why I like to keep a, <laughs> a three-foot banana on my counter at all times. Anyway, I... <laughs> I felt like maybe we'd return to freelancer mode, a mode that everybody played for about two days and then never touched again. So this is going to be fun. Before we choose what we're doing, though, I think we might head down to my local music studio to smash out a couple of beats on the bongos. Oh, hold on. Wrong room. Forget you ever saw that. <clears throat> Thank you for coming, everybody. I like to call this whacking on my sack. Yo, this is the beat that got you moving your feet. I sit here whacking on my drum. It's better than whacking on my bum. My bum doesn't go. Rapper pum pum. I'm whacking it for tips or for a pack of chips. After a few drinks, I'll be doing backflips. Yes, I live down here all by myself. And yes, all that alcohol over on that shelf is all mine, mine. All mine, 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 mine. It's not a drinking problem. I'm perfectly fine. Though I should probably give up smoking. Truth be told, I honestly don't even remember what I've got down here. This is clearly my bathroom. A lot nicer than I remember it. I, I thought it looked a little bit like a murder kill death room last time I was hold on let me just see yeah this is what it looked like <laughs> I don't know why I put down six tiles now this room right here in case you've forgotten this is the room where I come down and lay on this medical bed and I give myself <laughs> enlargement surgery before every mission now I guess there's no point trying to hide this you know I, I kind of already blew it yes I'm a bazillionaire um I owe it all to my success on the stock market look I always win except sometimes, but then I just keep on winning. Now, the funny thing is that I haven't actually played this mode in probably over a year, but apparently I was in the middle of something last time I was here or I began something or I don't, e I don't even know what the hell's going on. But looking over here, I've got pretty much everything on me shelf. Well, not everything, but I've got a lot of shit. And over in me box thingy, I got a whole bunch of stuff as well. Look, I've got every duck in the collection. And over here, what do we got? We got, oh, a can of petty. Nice. <laughs> oh, it's water. Well, that's less exciting. But I think I'll take the uncapped syringe. Sharp needles. Yummy, yummy. Anyway, with nothing on my person but the uncapped needle and a banana, let's get rolling, shall we? I have a feeling that the game doesn't want me to, to pick this one for some reason. Now to pick my prestige thing. Oh, I guess I'll go assault rifle kill epic. Hold on. Do I even have an epic assault rifle? Oh, yeah. I've got one with a silencer on it. All right. This is what I'm talking about, baby. Oh, oh, allo, Paris. Let's go. Oh, do this bad boy <laughs> oh wait hold on do i do i i need i need a um oh i don't even have a carry case for it well i guess i'll i'll put it back i can't go walking in there with an assault rifle on me back it's fine everything's fine who needs that anyway watch your step they're on high alert. Oh, okay, cool. Thanks for the tip, dumbass. Anyway, we got a couple of guys here. We got to be tactically testicle to take down these two. Now, hold on. Going to use the old fire extinguisher in the head. Slap it up a ding dong. Supreme special surprise. Look at that. Boom. Suck on that. Dick snap. Now I'll just drag Jose and his mate Hose B over, <laughs> over here and stuff them in the box. Select their guns because guns don't peep people, people, people. What the f- That's okay though. As soon as we head out here, everything should be A-OK. -okay. Oh, Dr. Phil. Hey, girl, mate. Raid Shadow Legends. A mobile game taking your fingers by storm. Hey, everyone. Um, you're bidding on me. One night with me. <laughs> It'll be the best night of your- It'll be the last night of your life. Now, this is the security room. Hello, gentlemen. How you going? I'm just going to disable everything. Um, where's the stuff? Oh, crap. Oh, dear. Sorry. Did I do that quite enough not to alert anybody? Was that... Oh, crap. Hello, how are you? Welcome to... All right, that's one down. <laughs> then, then to run upstairs and find the other target, which I believe is over there, sitting down in a chair, probably wearing no underwear. They've got a little surprise for you. Hey. Oh, crap. But first to jump through this window and loot the sparkly thing. Listen. Magic. Explore. Hello. We'll just use science to predict where this ball is going to land. I say it's going to land right on the money. Oh, no. That didn't... No. <laughs> that missed the target. All right. You know what? This looks promising. Hold on. Let's, let's go for the shot. Oh, mate. Right through the clacker. Now, I'm not one to brag, but I don't think anyone can argue that that wasn't the cleanest assassination... <laughs> 
assassination that anyone's ever seen. See you later, Paris. Then there I go, off to the Maldives by quad cycle. All right, so what I'm thinking is I'll open up my apartment. Excuse me, lady, this is private property. Now I'll um I'll set up my sniper <laughs> my sniper rifle and uh we'll just pop everyone from over here. Should be great. Actually, I don't I don't think we're gonna get through there. Let me try. No, nah, that's fine. Everything's fine. Let's go to the top of the tower thingy instead. All right, here we go. Oh, look at that. One of the targets is actually a tower dude. All right, so that guy's going in, which means that now it's time to get the old snippety snipey and get ready to take them all down before anyone has a chance to realize what happened. Look at that. Nobody even knows. Not even this guy or that guy. See? Clueless, all of them. You know, everything's still fine. Just got to wait for old mate to come in. Beautiful. That's what I'm talking about, mate. Hello, I would like a pizza with lots of salami on it and make it snappy. No pineapple. All right, so next target. There he is. All right, let's just zoom in. All right, another one down. And where's the last one? Oh, no. Thatch roofs, my only weakness. <laughs> How do they know? How about over? Yeah, this is this is good. You little beauty. See you later, Maldives. Anyway, this is me making my bed, mixing some music, and doing some weird stuff with my tie. But it's fine. Everything's fine. Matter of fact, I think I might slop, slop, sl <laughs> slop into my wardrobe and get myself something new and spicy to wear. I don't know. What do you think? A black suit? Something different. Now I am feeling extra spicy. Very nicey. All right, I guess my fishing trip's over. It's time to kill a couple of fools. So we're going to jump through this window, then set up the old snippety sniper rifle. Yep, this looks perfect for the job. Then we point this out the window, zoom in, get far enough back so nobody sees us, and we remind this guy that smoking kills. Oh, shoot. No, stop Agent 47, you stupid bloody idiot twit moron dickhead. Yeah, all right, so that was a little bit chaotic, but nobody knows it was me. Allow me to disappear into the wardrobe momentarily. All right, <laughs> I guess two minutes was enough time. Awkward. Now we've got this target over here too. Let's just do the old pew-pew in the back of the poo-poo. Then we sneak our way over to this bungalow, crack out the old pistol, and boom-boom, bang-a-bang-a-boom-boom. -boom. All right, you go, and you go. All right, nice one, and... Last target down. Now we just need to pick off everyone down here and then steal the boat and get the hell out. All right, I think the crisis is averted. That could have that could have been very bad, but fortunately it was great. See you later, bitches. Then just like that, it's time to head to Santa Fortuna for the boss of whatever the first phase is called. So having a look around, we got a couple of targets. I think we have to kill all of them. <laughs> wow, okay. We know that they have red hair. Red hair, okay. Hair wearing, and earrings wearing and glasses and, wearing and a hat. hat. What about this character? Let's zoom in. Who's this? Who are you? Who are you, stupid idiot? He doesn't have a hat, so it's not him anyway. Or maybe the hat's hidden. I don't know. I mean, this person has some sort of hood thing. Oh, that is a hat. Hold on. Is that? Is that? that that's that, that. Is that? That's not. He doesn't have a glasses. No, that's not it. I'll be honest, though. I have a feeling this is going to be trickier than I anticipated. There are a lot of potential. Hold on. There she is. That's the one. That's got to be her. And it looks like she's heading out of the mansion. So maybe I'll just wait a moment. Yep. She's on her way out right now, which means that your boy is just going to go boom. Oh. My bad. So <laughs> sorry. <laughs> All right, we're gonna have to do something about these two. There we go. No, can't can you just fall in the bloody water, you stupid idiot? Now it looks like somebody is heading out here. I don't know who it is. Who's this? Oh, red hair hat. Does he got? He got any other things? I don't know. Is that him? That was him. Slap it up a ding dong. Supreme special surprise. <laughs> How do I get that? See you later, Tuna Land. Hey, <laughs> nutcracker. All right, well, that's one leg of the syndicate taken care of, and now it's time for my present. da -dum. Jar Egger, seven covert. Great gun, albeit a little bit heavy. Hey, now this looks interesting. Assassination, murder for hire with no code or method, countless collateral. <laughs> Hold on. Wait, what? Are you sure my target isn't me? Then here we are back in beautiful Ambrose island after a very hectic bong sesh with, <laughs> with my mate Cheech over here and my other mate Chong who's mixing a bunch of homebrew meth. I'm doing my thesis about new applications for biotoxins native to Ambrose Island. Yeah okay nerd nobody cares. 
Anyway, we've got two targets and they're both over there. I think I might go dressed as a hippie. Actually, I can't help but feel like maybe I need a better disguise. Let me just pick off this guy while that guy's busy polishing his shoes and then make him disappear into the bush for all of eternity. That man has a very, very strong bum hole. All right, boys, here we go. Both of our targets get... Oh. Sir, what are you doing here? Oh. Surrender. Nothing. Nothing at all. All right, well, you know, we've already blown our cover now, so there's one. Now to hop down here and wait for them to forget about me. <laughs> Several song-filled hours later. Now to hop back up and go deal with old mate. Done and done. See you later, suckers. <laughs> They'll never catch me on this. Impressive work you did back there. I'm ready when you've prepped the next assignment. Then it looks like for this one, I need to kill two people with one bullet. And to do it, I feel like I probably need to go through this tunnel. Shame I can't read it. Hindi. I think it says enter here. But first, we've got a couple of guards that we... <laughs> that we need to take. Actually, hold on. I could just take this guy's clothes, couldn't I? Now, let me just retrieve my... Hold on. Wait, why is my sniper rifle considered an illegal weapon? I am a security guard of the law. I guess they don't like sniper rifles around here. Oh, well. All I ever wanted to do, though, was climb to the top of the highest mountains in Mumbai. And then very tactically... Stealth ascent. Oh, crap. Now, I feel like this might be a good location to get the collateral kill. Let me just crack out the old snipey snipey. And hold on, let me line you up. There we go. Beautiful. Now to get myself another change of clothes. And to toss this guy down the elevator shaft. Then we'll head over this way and... um. Oh, okay. There we go. Oh, hey. Hi. How you going? I'm just gonna leave this here. That's yours. Enjoy it. Then we sneak our way through all this muck. I assume it's human sewage, which is my favorite. And we pop out around here. We get our sniper rifle ready and we should, yep, we should have a nice clean shot to the final target. All right, let's do this. Zoom in. Wait for that guy. Go. Oh, he saw me, that cheeky bastard. Excuse me while I disappear into the sewage. And so after walloping this guy in the back of the head, mission complete. Really though, if I'm going to those lengths for $3,920, I am getting desperate. So so let's go make some more money in Argentina. Then here we are, the world's largest manufacturer of red wine. Something me likey very muchy muchy. I'm having a great time. Oh, the Malvin. Are you really? That's fine. Everything's fine. We'll just we'll get a new disguise if we can pull this guy in here. How do we pull this guy in here? Oh, but if we go up here, we're going to get frisked. That just will not do. I think we're going to have to exit the party and find another way in. And I reckon that I'm stealthy enough to sneak in here without them noticing. Look at that, look at that, look at that. I made it in and now to disappear into the lavender bush. Wow, I am so stealthy. Now to very stealthily sneak my way to the top of the sniper nest thingamajig. Make this guy have an accident. Kill that guy and that guy. And then wait for that guy. This guy is too BFFs. Three, I mean. Then we'll take a nice casual stroll down to the water where one of our targets is making sure we line these two up because we need a collateral kill. Nice. But before disappearing, I'm going to head back up to the top here and see if I can snipe my final target through that window. Let me just zoom in. Oh, we don't. he's not even in a window. Look at that. Beauty. See you, mate. Easy peasy. Don't cry for me, Argentina, because I completed the mission. Oh, hey, look at that. We unlocked some doof doof for the old safe house. But before we go to have a listen, let's change it up, shall we? Mmm, that's better. Oh, I'm so lonely. It's Christmas and I'm all by myself. That's fine. I'm going to go and make the world a better place. And I'll do that by heading to Dubai to take down the final boss of the second phase. And here we are in beautiful, beautiful Dubai. I guess this isn't the ICA Christmas party. Oops, my bad. I think I got out on the wrong level. Anyway, this is going to be a tricky one. I mean, there are a whole bunch of potential targets on this level. But what we do know is that they're having a meeting. They have earrings, a hat, necklace, um, red hair. They like reading and they eat the chockies. We also need to take them down with a silenced pistol and arrange a secret meeting with a burner phone from one of the other suspects. Now, this lady could be it. Red hair, necklace, earrings, hat. And then we've got this guy who's got the hat, the red hair, the earring, and the necklace as well. But after following him around, I realized he likes to come here and smoke. So, I brought a big banana. I'm gonna plop it down here and wait for him to walk on the top of it and then maybe I can get myself a boner phone to organize a meeting in the crapper. 
Oh, now did he? <laughs> did he drop? He did. Look at that. Business boner phone. What a what a way to stack it. Now I'm sorry, everybody. We need to clear out the dunny. We got some stuff to do. So what I'm gonna do is crack out the business boner phone, and I'm gonna ring it like right here and arrange a meeting um, just next to this door, and then I'm gonna just wait here and see what happens. So that guy is an assassin working for him. I'm gonna pop out and cap his ass. And we're going to make him disappear quickly before the other peoples come in. All right, we got another lady. Nothing sussed. Massive puddle of blood. It's all good. <laughs> oh, there's another one coming as well. Hold on. That's fine. Everything's fine. Let's just shoot every... Oh, there's a lot of people in here. Can we close the door, please? That's really weird. <laughs> That's right. That's the same guy. Now to uh, arrange another meeting right here. Nothing sus. Let's arrange an <laughs> another meeting, shall we, right here? Oh, no suspects with business agenda. What do you mean? All right, so no matter what I did, I could not get this lady to go to the meeting in the toilet. <laughs> that sounds weird. So I'm thinking that maybe if I just follow her around, I'll find the person that she's actually here to meet with, then banana them. This is the meeting, isn't it? Hmm, very, very spicy. Yeah, it seems like they are making an exchange, and so am I. Look at this big banana na 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 Nope. Oh, get out of it. This is so dumb. This is the stupidest game. It's so stupid. Later in the void. All right, idiot. Here you go. Second banana. Walk on it. Thank you. What's that? You got what, intercepted package. Nice. Thanks, mate. So let's head out here and plop the old plonker right here on the staircase thingy. This is a good place for a secret meeting. All right, here we go. There we go. That's the old targety. Hello, targety. How you going? Close that door. Boom. Boom. Dead. We're on the home stretch now, baby. Here we go. It's time to leave this place for good. See you later. Syndicate defeated. That's what I'm talking about. Boop, 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 boop. And for all my hard work, I get myself a brand new this. Anyway, that's the first two phases done. I think I'll save three and four for another video. But first, I head back into my treasury and play the stock market. My favorite game. Oh, sh oh, hey there, everybody. Sorry, I didn't notice you watching me. What am I doing? Oh, you know how it is. Just casually preparing for the zombie apocalypse. And snorting a tremendous amount of bullets directly into my nose. Anyway, here we are back with the freelancer hardcore challenge. Oh, baby. And as you can see here, we're now up to the the third leg of this catastrophically chaotic calamity. Anyway, before we get started, I think it might be a good idea to head into the wardrobe and get a new change of clothes. Black, 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 or black. How about yellow? Mmm, yellow. Me likey. Red ducky quack quack. And I think today we're going to go with the fertilizer because this video is literal sh- uh -huh, and it looks like Sapienza Italy's on the agenda. Though I'm going to leave it for the final showdown because it's the best location in the entire world of assassination trilogy. Don't believe me? Well, you can get. How about we go to Kong King China instead? Before I forget, melee kill, sniper kill, sniper. I like sniper kill. That's good. And as for the weapon I'm going to take, you know, I quite like that one. What's it called? The hackle? Hackle dackle? Hackle leviathan sniper rifle cackle. And here we are in Kong King China. Greatest place on earth. Makes me soaking wet every time. Uh, have you seen a girl around? Um... No. Sorry. Anyway, looking around the map. Okay, we got one there, one there, one there. One, wow. All right, four of them from the first mission. This is obviously not your average spicy, spicy, very nicey. Hello, lady. Are you here for the um the durability test? Go, go, go. You failed. All right, here we go. One of our targets is doing the washing. It's the last washing you'll ever do. Allow me to close this door. Strange bald white man walks into laundromat, closes door behind him. Nobody runs. Something doesn't add up here. <laughs> hey, get back here, you cheeky cheeky. All right, then guess we're taking it to the streets. Gangster loving. Then I'll stuff it back in me case. Wasn't me. What do you mean compromise, you dick snap? Do you think one of you delightful gentlemen? Oh, thank you, mate. You know, that's what I needed. I needed uh, a nice clean outfit that's not full of holes. That'll do nicely. So now that I've finished casually dispersing pretty much every guard in Kong King, China, I guess I'm going to head to the top of this building and disperse a couple more. Oh. Hey. Ah, what a delightful place. Sniper bullet, something that you can never have too many of. And a beautiful window going across the road to my target. Let's see if I can... Ah, walls, me only weakness. Bloody whiteboards, mate. How did they know? You know, I reckon... 
if I do that, then maybe this guy will come to investigate him. Okay, see, look at that, look at that, look at that. Boom, done and done. I am so good at my job. That's why I've got this nice hat. As for the last two though, it looks like they might be underground. So down we go. All right, looks like we're getting closer to our two targets and there's the door to ICA HQ, just, <laughs> just down some dark alleyway. Look at that, just through that crusty old door in an alleyway, we've come into the most technologically advanced room in the whole of um, space. Oh, hello. Look at that. One there, one there. You know what? I reckon maybe I could even snippety snipe it from over here, mate, with a little bit of tactical testicle. I reckon I got this. Let me crack out the old sh shish kebab skewer. We can do this. Hold on. Let me, let me see. One down. And where's the other one? There's his mate. Two down. Look at that, mate. Frickin' toasted him. Done. That's how it goes out here in the streets. You know, at the end of the day, all I ever wanted was just to buy some guns. Can you give me some? Please hurry up before I get shot. Oh, what the hell? It's all going on. Give me that one. Um, yep, yep. That seems cool. Give me that crap. Free drink. Shut up, mate. I gotta, I got oh, f I'm gonna die, mate. Hey, shut up, idiot. I'm trying to stay alive, mate. You're making it hard for me. Stop distracting me. Now to casually hop on the old subway and ride it all the way to Santa Fortuna, Colombia. The home of crack cocaine. Let's also do it dressed as a franger. What? I always drive to work in a hearse. You know what to do, 47. Yes, I do. Whoa, what a shock. Oh man, I feel like that probably wasn't the best idea for the start of the mission. But it's fine, everything's fine. Just give me a couple of minutes, so <laughs> I'll be back soon. Six months later. Now we'll turn on this radio, and if we're lucky, a change of clothes will come directly to us in this room. All we have to do is wait. <laughs> Then, then probably shoot this guy just to get the the compulsory complication out of the way. Where is he? Yeah, nice one, mate. Anyway, enough chaos considering we haven't even really started this mission yet. We got a whole bunch of targets to kill. Where are they? There's one, there's two, there's three, and there was another one. He's dead now. Uh, before we go any further, I think we might pay a visit to our good friend here, Mr. Guns Maximus Millionus. Anyway, let's take care of these two delightful gentlemen first. One and two. I'm a great shot, as you can see. And if we run over in this direction, I feel like we might be able to get a nice, clear line of sight. Yep. All right, hold on. This person's going to walk straight into it. Wait for it. Oh, boom shakalaka from downtown, mate. Right up the clacker. Now, we need to find a way to get into this tunnel. This could be a bit tricky, especially now that there's a dead person over there and they're probably looking for the person that did it. You know what? I might use this apricot to create a distraction. Let me just launch it over there. Mate, why are you looking at me? The apricot was over there. Go and investigate. Do your job, you lazy shit. All right, there he goes. And, um, you know, I'm going to make a run for it. Here we go. Mad dash, mad dash into the mine shaft. Oh, <laughs> here we go. Let's do it. Now, there are a lot of people here. I feel like the only way we can pull this off is just, oh, what the hell, mate? Give me that. All right, boys, here we go. Another target just waiting to be picked off from behind. Done. Now with one target left, I believe it's time to head up these staircases and deal with the... Oh, solo personal autorizado. That means if you gotta do it, you got authorization to do it, but only with one hand. Now, apparently, I am trespassing. I don't know why. I'm just a raincoated man with a gas mask and a shotgun on my back. Nothing sus. But just to make sure, boof for you. Terrible reflexes on you. Have a punch in the back of the head. Not today. Not today. Excuse me just a moment. Blip, 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 blip. Hacking mainframe. Da, 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 da. Now for a change of clothes and then to deal with the last target, which is right there. There you go, mate. That's your ducky for you. You want to pick it up and put it in your pocket? No, don't do it. Don't. Duh. And here comes old mate. Can you walk next to that lady? Just stand right there. That'll do. <laughs> Did that work? Yeah! Now to climb up this ladder, hop over the fence and ride the bus to freedom. But before I go, a little something something for the locals. Shit. You'll never take me alive. <laughs> Bulletproof buses, yeah. Why, hello there, ancestral assault rifle. Oh, mate, that's a cracker. Look at that bad boy. I didn't even know this thing existed. That's sick. Oh, my goodness. Only three locations left. I'm not going to lie. I'm a little bit sad. That Mendoza is probably my least favorite of the three, so let's get it done. There's for my prestige thingamajig katana, shuriken, or silent. Wow, we're going ninja mode out here today. And it seems like I'm saying my prayers. I don't know what that little head wobbles on. All about. Oh, I knew I shouldn't have had Taco Bell for dinner. <laughs>
<laughs> Please save me, Lord. So it looks like we've got one target over there that just so happens to be the lady serving all the food to all these people. Yeah, that's great. Fortunately, however, all I need is a clear line of sight from, you know, over here somewhere. Let's get all the way over here. Actually, this lavender bush seems like it will be great. Yep, yep, yep. And then zoom it all in and get that up ya. Whoa, what a shock. Hey, don't, don't do that. Now, this has been a delightful party, but I must move on, for there are bigger and better things for me to do, like crack out a sniper rifle in the car park. Matter of fact, I've got a pretty good feeling that I can pull this off from the top of the driveway, then jump into my limo and ride it to freedom. All right, let's deal with old mate first. Hold on, when nobody's looking, let me crack out the old shuzer. Get a shuzer up here, mate. Now, let me just take that back, because I'm a cheap bastard. Then, while old mate's busy being dead hanging over the railing, I'll crack out this bad boy, and, you know, I've got a good feeling about this fellas hold on look at that get it up ya right in the clacker let's pack it up and let's go home later boys <laughs> i'm floating <laughs> that car's literally floating anyway whittleton creek is sounding good right about now so we get bonus money for one disguise one accident and slipping on the banana perfection then here we are beautiful whittleton creek suburbia the happiest place on earth until i arrive anyway having a look around we got one there we got one there, we got one there, we got one there. And I've got a sniper rifle that can shoot through walls. So, hey, how you going, mate? I reckon the first thing we want to do is go take care of that melee kill. And this guy seems like he's the right man for the job. Hey, you going, buddy? Welcome to your circumcision. Well, that was excessive. Anyway, now that that's done, I'm thinking that I can probably hop over this fence, climb that ladder, and take everyone down from that attic. And we're in. All right, boys, let's jump through the window. I can hear a sparkly warkly. There it is. Hello, what you got for me? Oh, yep, yeah, this selection again. We'll go with the magnesium pouch. Helps me sleep at night. Then we'll crack out the sniper rifle and zoom in through the window. Now, where is that guy? There he is. He's behind a wall, though. I don't know if this is going to go through the wall or not. That's a bit sketch. Come out the door, then. Thank you. Oh, look at Janus the anus. Let's get him, too. <laughs> now, let's head up into this attic, and we'll deal with the final target. I don't know if they're in our line of sight. We'll figure it out. Don't worry about it. Everything's okay. No, we're definitely not getting them through this window. I'm flexible. But not that flexible. Or maybe, just maybe, maybe I am. Let me try. No, okay. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't expect that to work. Oh, he's, he's coming up here, is he? All right, mate. Come on. I'm waiting for you, big boy. Come on, baby. <laughs> you know, this guy actually might be a genius. He's very, very cleverly managed to just run around for the past couple of minutes without ever going into my line of sight. He's very tactically testicle. It is time that we handle this like men. Syndicate member eliminated. Look at me being extra discreet getting on the bus with, <laughs> with a ginormous sniper rifle bigger than me on my back. Thank you, bus driver. And just like that, it is time for the final leg of this, um, what's it called? A campaign stage thing. Sapienza Italy, bye bye. All right, so this is good. Collateral kill explosion. So basically, I can just drop a rubber ducky and blow up everyone in the vicinity and <laughs> it's going to be counted as great success. This is my kind of prestige objective. I like it. Just in case, however, I think I'm going to take my... Let me have a look at this bad boy. That is not gold, but okay. It's the it's the tan baller. It's what happens when you sit in the sun <laughs> with no underpants on. Welcome to Sapienza. Thank you, Diana. Great to be here. You need to identify the target Okay, first. all right, I can do that. However, yeah. they're on high alert. Oh, are they? All right. So you need to be careful. All right, well, you know, let me wake up first, woman. I'm just having a nap <laughs> in me coffin. So we know that they're here for a handover meeting. They have earrings. They have glasses. They have a hat. They have red hair. They have bookworm. They have foodie. All right, well, that's great. Now, looking around, we got targets. Absolutely. All right, we got one right there. Look at that. Earrings, hat, red hair, glasses. She could be the one. Let's see if she eats a food and a book. Now, one of my greatest strategies is just, you know, just keep it eye level. Just pop your little head over the fence or your eyeballs and just have a look what's going on. No one can see you. Very sneaky. Oh, all right. She smashed a burger that she just found on the railing. So we know at the very Leash is extremely hygienic. Nice to see you, sir. What? Shut up. Who are you, you freak? Oh, here we go. Look, two of them. Two of them. It seems like there might be a meeting going down. It's a perfect place for a collateral boom, boom, banga, banga, boom, boom, too. Oh, well, that's a phone. Nah, mate. What's that? Wait, hold on. Where's she going? Did she just organize the meeting? Is that what happened? Did I witness a meeting being organized? All right, look, 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 look. Meeting, meeting, meeting. I think. 
What's she doing? You know, I'm not taking any chances. Have a duck, you duckheads. Now to run outside and... <laughs> hey, that's what I'm talking about. Syndicate defeated. And I did it all dressed as a mob boss too. <laughs> Classic. Then for all of my hard work, I get this delightful gift from Diana. What is it? Oh... All right, cool. That's like m the worst gift she could have given me. <laughs> That's absolute ass. All right, here we go. <clears throat> Test one, two. Check, check. Yeah, yeah. Yo, this is the Hitman Freelancer. Beat everybody out in the street, moving their feet. I carry a gun with me, and I keep it in my bum with me. When it goes down, I pull it out, and I shoot people like I'm spearfishing a trout. Clap, clap, clap. That's not the sound of my gun. Clap, clap, clap. That's Diana's big... If you think I'm good, you can toss me a tip. But even if you don't, I don't give a ship. Because I got so many ships, bro. I got yachts. I drink... Drive them bad boys at 500 knots. Yeah, that over there is my drink shaker. Come over here and I'll make you something that'll give you a combo breaker. I hope you enjoyed this low class video. Some people would say for watching it, you're an idiot. But between you and me, you're the best. Now it's time for me to go have some rest. Laters. Oh, hey, hello. Sorry, I didn't notice you watching me. What am I doing? Oh, you know, just having a game of cards with myself, huffing down a fat Cuban stogie, sucking down a fat long neck, then chilling with my massive banana. And as we all know, behind every serious drinking problem is an even more serious bald cave. So here we are back down in Freelancer HQ, getting ready to smash out the fourth leg of this assignment. And to think we've already gone through one, two, three before this. Anyway, let's get some more clothes. Ah, uh, yes, this should do nicely. And for today, I'm going to go with Arms Trafficker because it sends us to Ambrose, Colorado, Hokkaido, Isle of Scale, Paris, and Whittleton Creek. And because Colorado is basically the Hitman level equivalent of ball cancer, let's get this out of the way first, shall we? Hmm, okay. Ice Pick Kill, Katana Kill, Silent Ascent. Well, that's definitely not going to work. <laughs> so I'm limited to these two. All right, I guess Ice Pick Kill it is. And here we are. Beautiful Cholera Dildo. The happiest place on earth. I mean, just look at that color palette. Anyway, looking around, we've got one target directly in front of us and another one all the way over there. I have a feeling that this is going to be an easy one, boyos. But first, I'm going to have to do something about this chap. Ah, he's turned around. Perfect. Look, it's amazing. You turn it on, and hay comes out the other end. Let me just sneak past these delightful gentlemen and head over to the weapons dealer and see what this guy's packing today. I'm sure it's something tasty. Oh my goodness, that guy <laughs> that guy's taking a massive piss. What the that's gross, bro. Oh, you're kidding. You're too, you're too busy to sell me something. You're just out there sucking down a durry. Yes. I don't, I don't know. I'll just take this. Thanks, mate. Hey, you. Show me those... Oh, dear. That's not good. All right, let me just put down a little trap. And, mate, you're going to need to just shut up and stay down, you twit. Oh, sorry. He's still talking. <laughs> He's still talking even after his neck got snapped. That's dedication. By the way, mate, this is all your fault. But it's fine. Everything's fine. Look at that. Look at it. Clean shot. Clean. No, stop walking. Oh, you idiot. You stupid idiot. All right, that's fine. We'll get you. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, crap. That was not the best shot in the world. Oh my gosh, I am a useless human being. That's fine. All right, here we go. This is this is where things start to get all hectic. Um, where's the bloody? Oh shite! It's fine. Everything's fine. We're nearly there. So smooth. Tactical testicle. Stealth assassin. Flexible murderer. Fair enough. How about this time we go create a little more chaos in Paris, France? And let's go with the epic sniper kill. Where is it? Where is it? The hackle. Here we go. The hackle dackle sniper rifle cackle. And here we are starting in the attic with our sniper rifle in our briefcase ready to cause some misery. Pain and misery. This one's for you. This one's for you. All right. Taken care of. Smooth. <laughs> Would you look at that? One of our targets is right here. That's gangbusters. So let's find a good position to deal with this guy. He's sitting on the pecuta. There we go. Nobody will even notice. Let's just zoom in. Spang. Nobody knows nothing because it's got a silencer. Now I think we might do the old double wacko combo again and take down these two guys. So there's one thing over your head and there's another thing over your head. Oh, you idiot. You stupid idiot. You dumb idiot. Now everyone's going to have to die. This is very unfortunate. It didn't need to be like this. Oh, look at this guy. He's just walking right up here. Well, that's handy. Let me just, you know. Now I'll just wait here in this dusty room until everybody forgets what happened. Later. 
in the void. Man, I've arrived at the location and it looks clear. Over. Okay, well, fair enough then. Ah, uh, but hold on, hold on. There we go. All right, there's one of our targets. It's the, the techie guy. You know the techie guy? He was a great techie guy, that guy. All right, so... <laughs> For some reason, um, you know, everybody's searching for me. I, I don't, and I don't even know what they don't even know who they're searching for. They're just all running up into the attic and getting domed. And because all the guards are dead, I can walk down the stairs without anybody getting in my way. And here we are. All right, let's get this done. Oh, it's all right. I got a good feeling about this. It's gonna go through this door. Watch. Now let me try. One, two, three, four, half, oh, five, and just like that. Escape has been achieved. Impressive work you did back there. Yes, I know, Diana. It's now time to do it all over again at Ambrose Island. This guy knows that I'm sus. Sorry, mate, but it's a prerequisite. Oh, what? How is there a, a guard right here? Sorry, folks, there'll be no running away today. You're just gonna have to sleep. Everyone sleep. Oh, that, <laughs> that was one of the targets. <laughs> what? You know, they say splashing some water on the face of an unconscious person wakes them up. So let's just splash this guy. Oh. Oh, he died. <laughs> His face isn't even in the water, though. You see, this guy I would understand, but this guy, not so much. Now, the uh, complication for this mission is a legendary headshot. So, you know, this will be legendary. There we go. All right, done. You know, this is, this is going to be a doozy for the local detective to figure out. <laughs> So let's keep on moving to our next target, of which apparently there's only one. This is going to be an easy one. I really shouldn't whack this guy in the head, but you know, it's all part of it. And I think he might, yeah, there we go, he's inside of the secret lair. Now, what I really like is that I'm not even trying, oh yeah, see, that's, it's hostile. It's hostile over this line in the sand. <laughs> there's not, you know what I'm talking about? I don't know. It's like, this is the invisible line right there is where things get hostile. Everything on this side of the sand is fine, but once you step over here, mate, you mess up your f So let's crack out the old banga banga boom boom. We're going to take down these two. All right, there's one. Two, and the camera. Three, all right, beauty. Oh, he's behind a wall, that cheeky bastard. Oh, and there he goes past the opening. All right, that's the opening where I gotta get it. Here we go, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, come on. Yeah, boy, that's it, done, done, and done. Let's stuff this in the case and piss off out of here. Oh, but before I forget, hello, double agent, you got some guns for me? You name it, I got it. Oh, yeah, you got any, um, you know, crack cocaine off? Now, I'm gonna need to run around with the sniper rifle in my hand and another one on my back, because I'm an idiot, so let's do that. And um, get this party over and done with. See you later, Ambrose Island. <laughs> Boat noises. Oh, only three levels left. Oh, I can't believe it. This was just way too quick and easy. And I think I'll go with collateral kills firearms. Um, and I'll just, again, use a sniper rifle. Like the good old hackle dackle cackle. And find a way to line up my targets with uh, some other unfortunate person. You know... <laughs> I don't know why they've put me in this abandoned bloodstained house with like literally nobody else. <laughs> what the hell? I don't know what happened here, mate. Oh, hey, what the hell? There's a dude in here. <laughs> There's just one dude. What are you doing, one dude? Oh, he's the plumber. He's fixing the stuff. All right, well, you know, I'll fix you. No! Yes! Now, I think, yeah, I might be able to reach that guy now. Let me just crack out the old doodah. See, we'll zoom in a little bit. All right, where is he? All right, there he is. But he looks like he's behind. Oh, he's that guy on the um stuff. That actually makes all of this so much easier. Or maybe... I could do it from a cubby house, a tree house. Yeah, that would be even more classic. Oh, this is this is dope, mate. This is like a this is professional right here. Tree house kill. <laughs> oh, here we go. Boom! That's what I'm talking about. Ha <laughs> ha. Now let's just lob that over the fence and then jump the fence so that we're not trespassing. Nothing to see here, everybody. That's my briefcase. Piss off. Then we'll be casually making our way downtown, walking fast, faces pass, and I'm homebound. Da -da 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 -da. And would you look at that inside of Janus the Anus's garage, there's an arms dealer. Typical. There is nothing strange about the garage door opening thingy being on the outside of the house. All right, mate, give me your goods. What do you got? I only sell good merch. All right, give me good merch. Let's go. Anyway, back over the fence we go. Then for a little bit of cheeky banger banger boom boom, this is for you and this is yours. Oh shoot, how did they even see that? That's so silly. It's fine, everything's fine, I'll just... 
disappear into this person's basement. Oh, hey, look at this. This is stylish. <laughs> oh, gosh. Don't get me started on my drum solo. You know, funnily enough, our target's right there next door in Janus the Anus's basement. And actually, speaking of which, that's his private bodyguard. Maybe if I throw him a duck, I can get him to deliver the duck to Janus and then, you know, I can blow him up with it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, 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 look. Oh, <laughs> I sucked in Janus. We're gonna blast that anus. In the meantime, I think I might see what's on the other side of this very suspicious door. What do we got in here, eh? We got books. Ah, uh, pull book. All right, let's pull book. What does this do? This da. Oh, what the hell? Wow. Hello. What's this room? All right, we got some clothes over here. What do we got? Okay, anus, a bodyguard, and a gun. We've also got garbage man attire. And what looks like a secret underground door that connects directly to our our target. Oh, nicey, nicey, spicy, ricey. And now all that's left to do is to get stealthy up in the his house. And then this is the target. Here we go. Hold on. Let's just smash him with some heads. This is yours. Oh, sorry. The wrong one. Sorry. This is yours. Oh, no, that wasn't it either. Was it maybe this? No. Okay. Maybe it's um this one. Nope. Okay. Well, that's my bad. Sorry. Maybe this one. Is this, is this it? Yeah, that's the one. Now to very stealthily hang this guy up in the wardrobe. Destroy the evidence. Bleep, 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 bleep. Da, 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 da. I like to see that they're maintaining <laughs> their computer system. Anyway, let's hop over the fence and join the party like a normal person. Nothing sus. And then as soon as Janus heads out on the patio to get a little bit of fresh air, we do some boom, boom, banga, banga, boom, boom. Oh, speak of the devil. Beautiful. See you later, Whittleton Creek. All right, all right, all right. It looks like we've got Isle of Scale and we've got Hokkaido. Let's go with Hokkaido. And none of these um, are any good. These are all absolute sh I mean, I can't really see myself taking a baseball bat on this mission and whacking someone in the head with it without getting spotted. But that's fine. We'll give it a crack anyway. And just in case, I'll also bring a nice silence pistol. I'll go with, uh, oh, I don't know what I'll go with. What will I? I'll go with the... Um, um, the ICA DTF Stealth. And here we are, beautiful Hokkaido, Japan, seemingly in the morgue. Oh, <laughs> okay, so this is how it is. All right, it looks like everyone's leaving. This is the perfect opportunity for me to hop up off of the bed and disappear before anybody notices that I'm not actually dead. Now, I reckon my first order of business is to not be trespassing anymore, at least momentarily. So let's head into the canteen. What are the chances we get through here without getting spotted, eh? We're only going to get past like eight people or something. Then the camera. Yeah, that's that's not working. Ah, but we can head through here. Then we take the baseball bat out of our briefcase. Don't ask how it fits. And we get ready for some good old-fashioned boom, boom, banger, banger, boom, boom. Look at that. So stealthy. Now to just hide these guys so that nobody ever finds them. And to head inside where finally we are a normal person. <laughs> yeah, right. All right, here we go. Another target heading downstairs. Maybe we can isolate this guy for the old baseball bat in the back of the head trick, eh? Yeah, all we need to do is open this door, make a little bit of noise. Come on, drop the thing out. All right, there we go. He heard that. Now we should come to investigate and then I'll get him. Maybe it was just a poltergeist. Nope, it me. No, no, oh, no. Excellent work, 47. Hello, handsome. <laughs> what the hell? That is not very professional. <laughs> All right, here we go. Old mate's coming down this way. We'll get another one. Are you all right? Yeah, he's fine. Get in here and shut up. Six months later. All right, so things may have got a little bit out of control, but it's fine. Everything's fine. Anyway, let's confiscate all of these illegal weapons that these cretins have brought into this hospital. Then we'll pick up our brief. Oh, nearly forgot. That was a lot of bullets <laughs> in the penis to take that guy down. He's a real man. Anyway, we got one target over here. I know how to deal with this one. This is for you, Mr. Champion Man. There you go. All right, let me just detonate that off. Oh, me. Did I even get it? I didn't get him, did I? So obviously my rubber ducky explosion didn't go according to plan. Actually, I take that back. Hold on. Syndicate member. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There he goes. See you later, sucker. Oh, wait. Hold on. You know what I just remembered? We still haven't got the safe yet. And it looks like it's where we started. Down in the morgue. Match 
later. There, now that we're in, the safe should be just around the corner. <laughs> what is this? What a disaster. Oh my goodness, is this every guard in Hokkaido? I had nothing to do with any of this. It is the morgue though, so, you know, it's not as weird as it looks. Anyway, here's the safe. Let's pop it open and see what we've got. Da -da! A $2 coin. Anyway, let's head up to the little lookout where the ninja likes to hang out because I am a ninja. Then I feel like this will be the perfect place to get the job done. All right. Well, maybe, maybe not. Probably not. No. Actually, you know what? Maybe, maybe, maybe I can do this, baby. Look at this. Look at this. One, two, three. Boom. I am so great. I am so great. G-R-A-T-E. And yes, this cliff leads to nowhere. <laughs> I didn't think that through very well. And just like that, we are now up to the final leg of this three-legged donkey. Isle of Scale. Ooh, baby. I've provided you with new intel. I don't care. Please shut your mouth. It smells like Taco Bell. All right, so for the final mission, what am I going to take with me? I think I'm going to take the good old, you know, the silver. No, I haven't taken this one yet. I'll take the old short baller. That's what I often get called because I'm actually two foot two. All right, unsilenced pistol kill. No, lame. Assault rifle, neutralizer, assault rifle. Which means that I'm going to need to find something very, very spicy that has a silencer on it. Not really many choices. The makeshift scrap assault rifle. This looks like ass. And here we are climbing out of the ocean in a hoodie. Completely not sus. Nope, I don't have a boat. I literally did climb out of the water. It's fine. Everything's fine. Now we've gathered some clues as to who we're looking for. We know that they're a handover meeting. They're an earring. They're a glasses. They're a grey hair. They're a necklace. They're a dehydration. They're a sweet tooth. They should be easy to find. Alright, you got red hair. It's not you. You got grey hair. Could be you. Oh, but this guy doesn't have glasses. Nope, not him. Alright, hold on. No, okay. Hey, it's... Lady me. <laughs> <laughs> You're looking great. So the remaining potential targets are all up here somewhere. Hey, guys. How you going? You waiting for me? I know I look great on the purple carpet. Purple and yellow LA Lakers. Get it up here. All right. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, hold on. Oh, it's, it's this guy. It's definitely this guy. He's, de he's this, this guy. Now, if we want to make this work, I feel like slipping around here, dropping the old briefcase, taking the old gun, climbing up this pipe is the perfect way to do it. I'll try and get up here without anyone spotting me. Just make sure that I'm extra tactically testicle before doing doing so and all right that went well and all i need to do is climb to the top of here and i've got the perfect shot many months later all right there he goes there he goes all right let's get into the perfect position get a nice clean shot from over here i can tell you that leader eliminated boo boo that's how we do it out here in the streets and i'm so stealthy that i did it all with oh this guy could spot me don't look this way champ let me just stuff it in me case and then very casually i run down the steps head down this way to the boat not my boat but that doesn't matter then just like that, campaign completed. Ba boy Impressive, 47. Oh, I know. You have single-handedly managed no, to No, I did it with two hands. I did I no. Look, come on, let's let's just be You're honest. Yeah, I didn't do it with one hand. Alright, I need to. Then as promised, well. Here we go. <clears throat> It's the freelancer beat. Everybody moving their feet. I go out in the street. I look at my phone to find my bank deets. I don't got them. So I can't get Taco Bell. Man, this is hell. I don't know what's wrong, but I smell. I open my mouth and the fumes come out. I walk in a room and the brooms come out. Am I really that stanky? Or maybe they're cranky. Cranky that Hitman so perfect and their game so janky. Matter of fact, you fools looking kind of wanky. You ever been to the gym? You're looking too lanky. Oh, you crying now here. Have my hanky. This is the last episode in this three-piece trilogy. There were moments where we laughed, but moments where it was like a thriller, G. No matter where we went, chaos ensued. People screamed and ran with their mouths open like they were looking for some food. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Soon I'll stick all three parts together and then I'll embroider it. I'll retitle it to the movie and I'll re-upload it. Uh, yeah, that was a burp. I'm feeling kind of bloated.